Hello everybody, today I'm going to be making my tutorial on how to add 3D Blender letters to your Rural Tag fan game with fonts because my audio didn't record in that one. I forgot to turn on my headset. But uh, yeah, I'm back now. The other video is now unlisted. So the first thing you want to do, you want to open up Blender and uh, you want to click A to select everything uh, and right click and delete everything. There should be nothing in your collection now. So now what you want to do, you want to click Add, you want to click Text. And now you can just you can click the tab button or just go into edit mode yourself and edit this text. I'm going to make it say subscribe because you, that's exactly what you should do for more tutorials like this. And then you want to go to your text, geometry, and extrude. You can, uh, a lot of people are like, oh, just put this as one. And then this happens. Uh, it's still pretty big. Um... That's what she says, but, um, the D, uh, what I recommend is point two, and then in Unity, if you import this in Unity, you can, uh, edit it all you want, um, and yeah, to add a font to it, what you want to do, you want to go to edit, preferences, file paths, and fonts, uh, put that as your fonts folder, and, uh, then you go to your, uh, click on, go to object mode, go to your text, I gotta wait for my blender to respond. Well, actually, it, it is responding. Never mind. Um, yeah, and then you want to go to font, and where it says regular, just click this, and Blender should open up a new window. I just gotta wait for it to load. Uh, my PC is kind of frozen. You may or may not be able to hear me right now. I'm not sure. Um, yeah, and then you have this, and uh, don't mind all these uh different folders. They're just random stuff that I have. Uh, the proof is for something that. Uh, you know, I'll make an entire separate video about that. But yeah, uh, you should see your font that you saved, and you want to click Open Font, and now you have your font here, and you can click File, Export, FBX, and then Import the asset into Unity. So, uh, yeah, that's all you need to do. I hope you guys have an amazing day, and goodbye.